it's fairly easy to fill out. I mean, you could fill it out in three or four days if you were quick. It took me a long time to fill it out. Uh, I got waylaid by certain questions. There is a question about whether I would bear arms on behalf of the United States. I'm in my 40s. I am a homosexual. I have a hyperactive thyroid. I have flat feet. If they call me up to bear arms, you know, everybody else will have to have died at this point. They, they, they're really scraping the bottom if they're calling me up. You have to show during the time you were a permanent legal resident that you didn't break any rules, any law, any regulation. They also ask you if you were involved in aiding or abetting or a member of the Nazi party from 1933 to 1945. It would be extraordinary, wouldn't it, to actually check yes and then be, you know, I wonder what they think of my application. Ooh. Are you a communist? Or have you ever been affiliated to a communist party? Which again, I'm like, that's still a problem? They ask you if you've ever been a prostitute or a bigamist. Prostitute, I understand, but bigamist. Bigamist is such an archaic term. I think they even ask you as well if you've been a procurer, which is a pimp. But a procurer, it's such a, it's such a lovely word, actually. There are qualitative limits on immigration. Certain kinds of immigrants would not be allowed. Prostitutes, people with criminal records, people who had health problems. And they asked me if I had ever been guilty of moral turpitude. I thought, for sure, who hasn't, you know? 